This story comes from Jane Yolen. It's called The Old Woman in the Cave. Once there was a man who had everything, a loving wife and family, success in his career, prosperity, wealth, respect, friends. But he was not happy. I want to know truth, he said to his wife. Then you should go and seek her. That was what his wife told him to do. And so he decided to do just that. But first, he put all of his wealth, his property and his possessions, in his wife's name. She being adamant about that fact. And then he set out on the road, a beggar seeking truth. He walked through cities and towns and villages, through desolate, barren landscapes, lush green meadows filled with fragrant wildflowers, past peaceful and calm lakes, and through deep, dark forests, and along wild, wind-swept seasides. And still he had not found her. He had searched for days and weeks and months. And one day he found her. He was climbing a mountain and there was a cave. He knew that truth would be inside the cave. He stepped in. And when his eyes had adjusted to the darkness, he saw her. Truth was a wizened, old, ancient, woman, thin strands of hair hanging down to her shoulders, bony shoulders that seemed al almost as if he could see the flesh hanging off of the bones, thin parchment skin stretched over the bones of her face, but her eyes were kind and her voice was low and lyrical and pure, and he knew he was speaking with truth. He asked if he could serve her for a year and a day, and she agreed. He learned more in that year and a day than he thought his heart capable of holding. He served her well, and at the end of a year and a day, he stood at the mouth of the cave, ready to leave, ready to return home. But first he looked at the wizened, ancient woman and he said to her, My Lady Truth, I am deeply grateful for what I have learned from you. Is there something that I could do for you? And the ancient woman tilted her head to the side and brought a gnarled hand to her face and thought and then her eyes lit up and she spoke with a low and a lyrical voice when you speak of me tell them that truth is young and beautiful